Here we go. Imagine this graphics probably lagged the computers back in the day. I can't remember, so most likely. Okay. Ooh, we can start killing here. Who are you? Oh, yeah, no. Okay, night. I see thou hast met my children. This is Kazi. Oh, she's Eta, here. And Zil, the most beautiful daughters of Cain thou shalt ever meet. <laughs> Unfortunately, Teta and Zil lost the ability to speak during their <laughs> mortal lives. I found them in servitude to a rather harsh master that saw to it to remove their tongues. <laughs> he was dealt with in a fitting fashion, eh, Sarah darlings? <laughs> Don't worry. Kazi is happy to speak for the three of them now. We come seeking Bruja taken as slaves from Prague, a mortal woman among them. Slaves? Oh God! Oh yes, the slave business have been so very delicious. Duke Leopold needed a force to beat back the Senitze, and the Lord, the Tremir appeared as if by divine providence. <laughs> The Tremir and Zemitsi battle each other with surpassing fury. And I, humble Ventru that I am, I profit from the selling of slaves to both clans. <laughs> the Duke and I shall ensure that the Tremir win the war. But only after I have collected much treasure from the carnage. Then shall we destroy the wounded Tremir as punishment for the blasphemy they committed upon the antediluvian Salim. Tell us of the October shipment from Prague. <laughs> Does thou think me a fool? That I will give away that which thou wilt purchase. <laughs> Presumptuous bumpkin, shouldst mm. thou wish to know of thy allies, thou shalt perform a mission for me. Oh. <laughs> okay, or we shall slice thy head halfway off thy neck, and then shalt thou beg to tell of our allies. Very well. I think it's best to go with this one. Do we threaten him? What happens? Uh, we, we could try to threaten him actually. Or we shall slice thy head halfway off thy neck. Then shalt thou beg to tell of our allies. <laughs> the Duke himself protecteth my haven. Attack me. And thou shalt suffer the most grievous retribution. And thou shalt never find thy wayward slaves. No. <laughs> Enough <laughs> of such talk. It is business that we have to discuss. No more. Come, come to my study where we may discuss this. I sent a battle coming. Mayhap thou shalt find some delicious morsels to refresh thee. Mm -hmm. God, he's annoying. Pray, sup with me. I trust that thou will find these orders to thy liking. Oh. If they are not pleasing to the taste, we shall have them flogged. <laughs> well, we could drink a bit with everyone, I guess. State thy business, Orsi. Well, I can see thou hast no courtly manners in the bumpkin. <laughs> Listen well. The Tremere have clapped their slaves away in the Tremere Chantry, thy house de Hexe, the most protected heaven in Vienna. Uh, which house, so I guess? Do not think to try to kill me to gain them. They are quite beyond my power. Only Duke Leopold could convince the Tremere to give up their slaves. The Duke 
is responsible for allowing the Tremere to lodge in Vienna, so the Tremere do his bidding. Assist my ally, the Duke, and okay. he will owe thee a boon. Hm? What does the Duke wish? The end to the reign of the pestilential vampire priest Luther Black. Years ago, Luther was but a mortal priest of Stephenston Church. A wayward La Sombra sought to rule Vienna by controlling the church and dared to embrace Luther. We sent the sire to hell, <laughs> but Luther locked himself away from the outside world. He hath retained a pitiable hold on the faith he had in life and sleeps by day upon a cross of pure silver. <laughs> Quite uncomfortable, I assume, but he fancies himself a martyr. The Duke has been unable to remove this blasphemous member of the Shadow Clan since Luther is ensconced within a ring of holy ground. Then how do we find him? Better to ask how to bind him. Thou cannot destroy him. The priest has strange powers beyond thy ken. But thou can restrain him. <laughs> Here are chains even Luther Black cannot break. I am a master of metalwork, and I have forged these shackles from a new unbreakable alloy. Thou mayst find them useful, and more reliable than the <laughs> magics in thy blood. Destroy Luther Black, and the Duke will retrieve thy slaves. <laughs> uh, I was probably supposed to read that. To my liking, I'm afraid. I prefer blood of a nobler sort. Tis my only vice. <laughs> Enough of this dainty preening and strutting. How do we reach the La Sombra? Refinement is wasted on lumbering brutes such as thee. <laughs> there will come a time when boorish churls are put in their place. <laughs> Thou shalt find a concealed entrance to the church behind our famous astrological clock in the inner strat is a hidden passage. Enter by night and wait inside for daylight, and thou may uh -huh. steal into the inner haven undetected. <laughs> oh, what? We shall undertake thy mission. Good. Now get the hence. <laughs> so we need to what we couldn't even taste them dude Away with thee. uh so we need to do this turn day what the fuck oh hello so christoph has not yet perished at the hands of the vampire priest <laughs> The deadly nature of thy mission inflames my sister Tata, and my sister Zil entreats me tell thee that she too is filled with lust for thee. Uh -huh. She cannot resist the charms of an immortal so close to death's door. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's go. So, Christoph has not yet perished at the hands of the vampire priest. Okay, so it's the same shit. They couldn't talk, I think, so. So. No. It's even laggy a bit for me, what the fuck? Badly optimized, I guess. So the quest is now... Find secret entrance to clock and find Luther Black. Okay. Yeah, let's continue in the next episode. <laughs>